10 Intriguing Pitbull Facts There is likely a wealth of information you are already aware of or believe you know about your beloved Pitbull. In this article, we will explore some intriguing information about their lineage and characteristics, as well as other intriguing tidbits. Number 1. Pitbulls do not make great guard dogs. Many Pitbulls are trained to serve as guard dogs. This is understandable, as a lot of them may appear intimidating, and a trained pit bull used for protecting against intruders can pose a significant threat. They can also show a strong sense of protectiveness towards their owners. Nevertheless, the majority of pit bulls are still not ideal guard dogs. Many experts on dog behavior believe that terrier breeds are generally overly friendly towards unfamiliar people and may not exhibit strong territorial instincts needed for guarding. Regardless of this, Pit bulls are typically very alert dogs and can still serve as effective guards in warning off and deterring potential intruders. However, if you are looking for a reliable guard dog, it is recommended to consider different breeds. Number 2. Baby pit bulls have a unique wrinkled forehead at birth. When a pit bull is born, they typically have a distinctive wrinkled forehead. This small piece of skin will become smoother as they grow older, eventually resembling the pit bulls we are familiar with and adore. Nevertheless, it is notably intriguing as scientists are unable to provide a clear explanation for why this phenomenon specifically occurs in pit bull puppies. Number 3. Pit bulls do not exist. So what is the reason for me to be reading this article? Feel free to inquire. The term pit bulls is somewhat inaccurate. Indeed, pit bulls are not acknowledged as a separate breed by the American Kennel Club. Typically, when we refer to the pit bull, we are actually talking about various dogs of the pit bull breed within one family. This typically involves dog breeds known for their aggressiveness, like the American Pit Bull Terrier, Staffordshire Bull Terrier, American Staffordshire Terrier, Pit Bull Terriers, and the American Bully. Numerous dogs of mixed breeds that exhibit pit bull traits are incorrectly identified as pit bulls. Despite their similar appearances with short, stocky bodies and wide heads, these dogs are actually various breeds from the same family. Nevertheless, we will continue to refer to them as pit bulls because family is family. Number 4. Pit bulls can and like wearing clothes. The majority of pit bull terriers possess a short coat, which is easy to maintain but can leave them vulnerable to cold temperatures or sun exposure. Specifically designed for dogs with very short hair, dogs experiencing anxiety or stress may find solace and security in wearing a snug and warm garment. While a vibrant outfit will enhance their visibility to vehicles while outdoors. Although some dogs may not enjoy wearing clothes, there is no evidence suggesting that any specific breed has a preference for them. Pit bulls in particular may receive added advantages from the additional layer and identification it offers. Being scared of a nice dog in a cozy sweater is difficult. Number 5. Pit bulls do not have a lock jaw. There is a widely believed misconception that pit bulls can lock their jaws when they bite and cannot be released. Despite having a powerful bite and strong jaws, pit bull type dogs, particularly the American Pit Bull Terrier, are not even among the top 10 dogs with the most powerful bites globally. Typically, they are surpassed in ability by mastiff breeds. In the same way, most mammals, including your pit bull, cannot physically lock their jaws as it is not possible. Number 6. Pit bulls are not only fighting dogs, Many individuals view pit bulls as aggressive dogs due to their reputation as fighters, contributing to negative stereotypes. The ancestors of pit bulls, particularly the English bull baiting dogs, were specifically bred to be strong animals. Their job was to keep control of big animals like bulls in fighting arenas called pits. Nevertheless, after the ban was enforced, a lot of the initial bull baiters were crossbred with terriers to create more suitable pets. Although certain pit bulls were specifically bred for success in dogfights, this does not apply to all individuals of the breed. Indeed, both the terrier and the original bull baiter were not known for being especially fierce or hostile breeds. Several baiters also retired, with certain individuals breeding them to improve their skills as both companions and guard dogs. People have been called nanny dogs, but there isn't strong historical proof apart from their presence in family pictures. Number 7. BSL does not greatly reduce dog attacks. BSL, short for breed specific laws, are regulations that control or prohibit the breeding or ownership of specific dog breeds or enforce rules about bringing dogs into public areas. Typically, these laws are aimed at dogs that are specifically recognized as pit bulls. 
Nevertheless, the majority of cities have discovered that there has not been a notable decrease in dog attacks based on statistics. Dog attacks continue to occur, occasionally with regularity, even in regions lacking pit bulls or pit bull mixes. Number 8. Pit bulls can be very intelligent. In the Corrin test, which assessed the trainability and ability to comprehend commands of 138 dog breeds, many were shocked to learn that the American Staffordshire Terrier was ranked 48th in terms of intelligence. Even though it may not seem very noteworthy, it still places the American Staffordshire Terrier in the category of above average intelligence. Numerous trainers also concur that the Pit Bull is a comparably simple dog to train in comparison to numerous other dog breeds. Number 9. Here are a number of famous Pit Bulls. The Pit Bull has been in demand since the 1800s and some have gained significant fame. President Teddy Roosevelt and Woodrow Wilson both had Pit Bulls as pets while residing in the White House. Although we can't identify the specific breed, they appeared to be the American Pit Bull Terrier. Another well-known pit bull was brought to the White House during the early 1900s. That was Sergeant Stubby, revered as a hero and mascot for the American military during World War I. He prevented numerous casualties by alerting others about gas attacks and capturing a German trespasser. Sally Ann, a female pit bull, was also known as a hero and mascot during wartime. During the Battle of Gettysburg, she protected several wounded Union soldiers in isolation. This courageous young woman sacrificed her life to save these men, and has been recognized with a statue in her memory in Pennsylvania. Many pit bulls have been chosen as mascots for the American military because of their bravery, loyalty, and determination. Even during World War I, they were utilized on posters to promote enlistment and the purchase of war bonds. Nevertheless, stories of courageous pit bulls can also be found in sources other than history books. In California, a pit bull called Wheela reportedly rescued a boy from a rattlesnake. In 1993, Wheela rescued 30 people, 29 dogs, 13 horses, and a cat when a dam broke in her vicinity. Partially by supplying aid to the stranded and partially by directly rescuing them. Number 10. Pit bulls can socialize well with other animals. In addition to being known as aggressive dogs, Pit bulls are also often labeled as antisocial and hostile towards other animals, particularly smaller dogs or cats. The pit bull, inherited from its terrier ancestors who were hunters, does display a strong instinct to hunt for prey. This natural tendency could be more heightened in breeds that have a higher percentage of terrier ancestry, like the American pit bull terrier. Nevertheless, this characteristic does not increase their likelihood of attacking a smaller animal compared to any other terrier breed. Many pit bulls have actually been employed as cattle dogs and have been proven to get along nicely with other small animals and fellow dogs. Ensuring your pets meet in the right circumstances is key to successful cross-species socializing. Enable your pets to become familiar with each other's scents and introduce them in a peaceful, laid-back environment. Thanks for watching.